<sighs> well, this is it, fellas. This is the commentary for the scrapped Final Sir Calco video, which was the top 10 of... Uh, top 10 amazing characters for Super Smash Bros. Um, yeah, so this was the video I was working on uh, before I decided to quit Sir Calco for good. Um, and it was intended to be an April Fool's video about, you know, my most wanted Smash Bros. characters. Um, and that's and that's why, like, all these character choices are just, like, really bizarre choices or, like, memes or something like that. Uh, because it was intended to be released on April Fool's Day. Um, but, you know, the problem with that came from, you know, I have to upload this video on April Fool's Day, so that meant I had a pretty tight deadline to get this done. I had to get it out on that day, otherwise it wouldn't make sense. Um, and I really got stressed out, uh, trying to get it out on time. I remember specifically on March 31st, n yeah, March 31st, I was working on it, I was really stressed out, and I was realizing, oh man, I got all these drawings done, but I still gotta, I got the audio done, but I still gotta, like, put all the audio together and stuff and oh it's gonna take me so long so I got really stressed out and I started I started crying about it which is honestly pretty sad looking back but um uh, I ended up I talked with my parents about it and I came to the decision that I was going to quit YouTube uh, again because this happened before uh, but this time ended up being permanent uh, sort of uh, there was no return to Sir Calco after this at least none that was successful <laughs> but that's that's a whole nother story in itself uh, but yeah so this specific upload I'm talking over is the scrapped uh, video upload I, I made of it uh, back in 2018. Um, so in 2018, I wanted to post this video since I realized it was pretty much done. But I didn't want it on my main channel since it was real. I mean, for one, it was unfinished, obviously. Um, and two, uh, it was severely outdated because... Uh, of all the memes that I use as characters in this. And those memes were... Like, most of those memes were dated even by the time I was going to release this video originally. Because a lot of them were from 2016, like Stingy and The Onesler. Um, so obviously in 2018, that would have been even worse. So I didn't want that on my main channel. Plus, there was the fact that at the time, I was working on a collab video with IC for his channel. That would have been like my comeback to YouTube as Sir Calco. Um, so the plan was, once we finished that video, I was going to start uploading to Sir Kalku again. So obviously I didn't want this scrapped video on there as, like, my first video in a while. Because it's not really representative of what I do. Uh, funnily enough, that collab was actually going to be a video on obscure characters for Smash Bros. But instead of being just complete jokes like this, it was like we would choose really bizarre characters, but then we actually came up with, like, cool movesets and stuff for them. Um, that video ended up being really fun. Um, I want to do a scrapped video that goes over that someday, um, but I see lost the original script for it. Uh, so hopefully we can find that so we can actually talk about it more. But regardless, so that's what I ended up doing. Um, I decided to rebrand this channel. Uh, I decided to post it to Kalko Animation Studios, uh, but I rebranded the channel to be like my second channel as like a dumping ground for all my other stuff uh, and called it Sir Kalko 2. Um, I ended up, since, since this was just going to be like an archive scrapped video and not really like a good full quality version of it, I just hastily exported all the clips that I had finished and just stitched them together in iMovie. Um, and then for that intro part, I literally just made walls of text to read. Um, I originally thought about doing like an actual voiceover segment where I would talk about, um, why I scrapped the video and stuff. Um, but I didn't want that taking up more time in the video. Like, I didn't want my explanation to take, like, a minute, 30 seconds of this. So I ended up doing the wall of text so it could go by faster. Um, but it, it just looks really cheap and, like, so tacky. So I kind of regret doing that in the long run. But, oh, well, what can you do? Yeah. So, yeah. Another thing, since this was a scrapped video, um... I didn't go, I didn't bother to add the background music or like any additional sounds that I couldn't find. Uh, cause that would kind of defeat the purpose of an archive. Uh, at that point, I would just be finishing it at that point. Why would I put that much extra effort? Plus, it's all about preserving like what I had finished at the time, anyways. So that was my reasoning for it. Now, there are several clips in this that, you know, are missing and I never bothered to replace because I was just doing an archive upload. 
Um, so the first one is um, of Officer Dubois from Madagascar 3. So I talk about how there's a scene of her running through walls. Um, and there, a clip of that was supposed to appear here. Um, I actually did download that clip on my phone uh, using a YouTube downloader app that I had. Uh, that app was really shady. Like, I, I'm surprised it didn't give me like 7 million viruses or something. Um, but I did download that clip, but I didn't use it in the archive for some reason. I think because I just didn't have... No, it was because I deleted the app app before I uploaded this archive. So I didn't have access to it anymore. So that's why it's in there. Um, and instead of that, I just did... Um, I just wrote down insert clip I couldn't find here. And then uh, the price is right losing sound effect. Obviously, that wasn't in the original video. That was something I added for the archive upload just so that segment made sense and there just wasn't, like, a gap in between. Um, so, yeah, just to be clear, that would not have originally been in the video. I think it's about to show up. <laughs> yeah. Wow, that's really funny. Anyways, there's also a second mi missing clip right here where I talk about Dubois' victory theme. Yeah, okay, so that was originally going to be a clip of her uh, from the movie that was like a running joke between me and my brother where she went like, a hippo, a giraffe, a zebra, a lion. Um, and that, and my brother and I thought that was really funny, so it was a run, uh, running joke between us. Uh, but I never found it. Uh, what's interesting is that, that, that part of me yelling victory theme, that was obviously recorded in 2017 when I originally recorded the audio. So I guess... Even back then, if I had finished the video on time, um, that clip wouldn't have properly been in there. Uh, so I just thought that was interesting. That was, yeah. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, there's one more clip uh, missing, and that's uh, Carl Weezer getting thrown into an airplane. Uh, this one didn't really have a placeholder in the spot where it was supposed to be in the video. I think there's just like a scene where I'd go like, does anyone remember that show? anyone and then just abruptly cuts to rip Carl Weezer. There was supposed to be a clip there of Carl Weezer being thrown to an airplane which is an actual scene that happened in Planet Sheen. Um, I guess for some reason I didn't f I either didn't find it or didn't bother to put it in there for the scrapped upload so it's just kind of doesn't really make sense there. So it would have been nice if I include that in the archive um, but no I guess that wasn't worth the effort apparently. Um, so I think, oh, this joke, I think the, this joke was a pretty funny idea. Um, uh, it's obviously outdated now, uh, and even, yeah, even by the time that I uploaded this as a scrapped video, uh, Ridley was announced for Smash, so the joke didn't, doesn't make sense at all anymore, but it's a, it's a, it's a very funny concept. Um, though I wish I was a little more vague with the drawings. Uh, I think it's a little less subtle that way. But yeah. Whoa. No way. It's going to be Ridley, right? Oh. Oh. Oh, you got pranked. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure that all-star background music I had to record for the archive uh, because it, it didn't make sense. The joke wasn't as funny without it. Um, yeah. I, I think that's pretty funny. Hey, here's Carl Weezer. He makes a very, I make a very funny joke about Mega Salamence being a croissant. That's a reference to uh, the Smash, or not the Smash Bros, the Pokemon Pseudo Legendaries collab with IC. Pretty, pretty funny stuff. Why'd I draw a gun there? Oh, that, that's just the same joke I made in the Kirby video. What are you doing? Okay, I know there's a clip coming up where I use, like, I use a clip from Jimmy Neutron of uh, Hugh Neutron singing the Donut Boy theme song. Um, except I didn't bother audio balancing it. Uh, so I believe it's extremely loud in this archive version. Uh, what the heck? Sorry, I'm watching this on YouTube and I just got an ad? Huh? What is going on? Why am I... I don't care about why is there an ad on this video? I don't have ads in it. I don't even have monetization. Did YouTube add that as a okay, whatever. Okay, anyways, um, okay, back to it. Yeah, so there's gonna be um I think there's gonna be something really loud. I currently have my volume at one right now. So I'm going to see um 
How how bad is this going to be if I have my volume at the absolute minimum? Let's see. Oh my god, yeah, that's really bad. Uh, I'm really sorry if you watch this, uh, like, with headphones on and aren't expecting that to come up. Um, I really wish I had at least... Like, I, I think that was the joke, was that it was supposed to be ear-piercingly loud. So I want it to be that way, but in retrospect, really bad idea. It's just... It's just... It, it hurts, man. Um, Stingy. This is what I was talking about with the outdated memes. Stingy was from 2016. Um, so not really as funny. But I like I do like the joke of him just claiming fighter. Like, especially the joke of him just claiming another playable character is his. I like that joke. It's a good joke. To some extent, I'm a little sad this video never officially released because some of the, some of the jokes in here I do think are pretty funny, even if they are based on outdated memes. Uh, like, this video really does not hold up well if you don't remember 2016 memes. Um, here's another clip I actually uh, got from YouTube. Um, at least this one's properly audio balanced. Um... Oh wow, he's so cool. He is such a thug. Whoa, look at that. Funny. Um Oh yeah. <laughs> this is another clip I got from YouTube for just for the upload uh, archive upload. Uh because I just found this particular video of Deja Vu playing over Stingy running over Sporticus really funny. Um good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, we're coming up on the end here. Um, spoilers alert, uh, spoil, ugh. Uh, I'm tired. Spoiler alert, this is an extremely unfunny Illuminati joke. Um, I just thought Illuminati confirmed was just the funniest thing back then. I am surprised I did not make more of those jokes in the Sir Calco video. I think, I think this is the only time I bring it up here. Um, I was, there, I think there is an Illuminati joke in the top 10 Gen 2 Pokemon video that I never finished, but that was it. I admire my restraint there. I'm surprised I did not beat that joke into the ground at all. Um, yeah, that is pretty much the end of the video. Um, coming up here, we're going to have the Grimmer Reaper finally make his grand reappearance. Uh, the Grimmer Reaper, Coolco, and Oclock were all from the top 10 worst Gen 1 Pokemon video, and they were supposed to be, like, the cast of recurring characters I have. Um, and yeah, um... They were supposed to, this was where they were supposed to start appearing more regularly. Grim Reaper reappears in this video, and Ocklock was going to be in the Pokemon Sun and Moon review. But those never happened, so that's a shame. But yeah, that was the end of this. Um, I originally planned on returning to YouTube in 2018 with a obscure Smash Bros. character collab with IC. Um, that video, uh, that was a production nightmare because I spent so much time on the script and the draw. I made so many drawings for it, uh, to the point where I just was like, Hey, I see, can we, uh, do you think we could upload this on my channel? Cause I'm spending so much time on it. Uh, and he was understandably not really too sure cause he wanted to have a collab on his channel. Um, but then a production of that video kind of fell apart on November 1st, 2018, whenever Piranha Plant was announced for Smash Bros. And that kind of... That kind of messed up the point of our video because the joke was supposed to be like we just took these random obscure characters and made movesets for them. Uh, but n now that Smash Bros. officially had done that, uh, I didn't really feel like as unique of an idea. So we just ended up kind of halting production on that. And that video uh, just faded to dust. Sad. Um, Yeah. Uh, this YouTube upload, for some reason, I uploaded in 360p. I genuinely don't know why. I, I exported in iMovie, so I could have easily done it in 1080p. Um, but I do still have all the original assets for it, so I think it would be fun to one day do, like, sort of a remaster that actually finishes this video with, like, background music, higher quality drawings, maybe the correct clips I was looking for. That might be fun to do at one point. But for now, it just remains a piece of scrapped history. And now, Sir Calco's over. This is the last commentary. Uh, it's not the last, it's not the last commentary for me specifically. As of right now, I haven't recorded the pseudo legendaries commentary because I want to, I want to meet up with Icy in person and record that together. Um, but at the time I'm recording this, uh, this is, you know, chronologically, if you're watching this in the future, this is going to be the last one. So, uh, it doesn't really, uh, I guess there's not really a point to me mentioning that. Um, I'll stop rambling. Uh, bye.